Welcome everyone, Yifi here with another video. So what do we have today? It's something that we rarely have on this channel, a blind buy that is a fail. I usually do my research properly and I also did it with this one, but I have trusted the reviews and the comments and the votes on Fragrantica and I ended up buying something that I do not want to buy anymore or even have it in my collection. I ended up buying this fragrance, Zirch Icon, which is supposed to be like one of those cheap hidden gems, but that's not the reason why I blind bought this. And I'm gonna say from the start, it wasn't like a complete fail because this is cheap. So when I'm not completely sure about something, especially with the expensive fragrances, I don't usually blind buy those. But with this, I thought, you know, for that price, it's worth a shot, but it was not worth it, even for that price. So on Fragrantica, people say that this fragrance, Ser Haikon, smells similar to John Varvaro's Dark Rebel, which is an awesome designer fragrance with niche quality, now rare to find. And I thought, you know, I'll save this for, you know, special moments. I'll save it like a collector fragrance and I'm gonna spray myself with this one. And I wasn't expecting it to be like, you know, a clone. Uh, I'm familiar with clones and I know what to expect from time to time. And like I said, I was expecting maybe a 50% similarity with, you know, cheap quality, not as good as this one. But, you know, I would say that this is not even 7% similar. What this is, is one of those cheap smelling fragrances. It has a cheap generic and dated smell. If you have smelled some good fragrances, you'll notice that this one doesn't smell good. You know, it could be like a good scent for someone who gets now into fragrances and you know, he just wants to spray something on himself. This is supposed to have incense, it's supposed to have some interesting notes which don't really pop up. This is just a generic smell and doesn't have any complexity. So can you really trust people, the reviews or the votes on Fragrantica, not always. And unfortunately, there are perfumes, lots of them, like this one, which you cannot find in store to test it for yourself. So you have to blind buy it. So yeah, guys, final conclusion, Zir Icon, I do not recommend it. The only good thing about this is that it comes in a 125 ml size. And that was it guys, until the next video, watch out for these blind buys, you might get one of these. And what else? There was something else. Oh yeah, keep smelling great.